got the ride. The hourglass is on the last few grains of sand. You must reach the vault by any means necessary. We will not get another opportunity like this in your lifetime.
This is it. The reason you're here. I guided you to this point and you've done so well. Know that you are ready for this. When the vault opens, brace yourself. I believe in you. You can do this.
have failed to listen to Commandant Steele. I've warned you time and again, yet you persist on ignoring my orders. The contents of the vault are rightfully the property of the Atlas Corporation. But you? <laughs> you belong to me. Get your team ready to go inside. Don't give up. This creature may be immortal in its own realm, but in this reality, it cannot survive without a host. And that makes it vulnerable. When it becomes flesh and blood, it can be hurt, even killed. Just need to know where to aim. Sorry, I couldn't warn you about what was in it. But for you to be there to stop it, it couldn't have unfolded any other way. You did well, and your actions haven't gone unrewarded. The key won't open the vault for another 200 years, but I'm sure Tannis will pay you quite the fortune for it. Now go. I'll be watching.
Armaments here. We got guns over here. Keep your eyes open. And effectively, that is the end of Borderlands. At least the first game. The DLC don't really <sighs> tie Borderlands to the second game. From what I see. So. Nor do they really... Well, they do kind of tie to Borderlands pre-sequel, but yeah, not really. 